for the start of the 90th General Assembly session. And 4029's Una Lee spoke with some local lawmakers about what they expect out of this year's session. It's new at 5. For the first time in 100 years, Republicans will control the governor's mansion and both legislative branches. Some of the main issues will focus on the budget, private option, education, and prison overcrowding. Republican State Representative Charlie Collins of Fayetteville says the dynamics will really change, and he believes the 90th General Assembly will have a balanced budget. He hopes to lower income taxes even further to make Arkansas more competitive with surrounding states. I also spoke with Democrat State Representative Greg Leading, also of Fayetteville. He says he plans to run a bill to establish voluntary paid family leave, presumptive protections for firefighters, a new jobs training program, among many others. State Senator Bart Hester of Kay Springs tells us that he will be running many bills ranging from making medical school acceptance only merit based to making K through 12 inter semester classroom sizes a little bit more flexible. Senator Hester says he believes the main issue this year will be tax cuts for the middle class, also Medicaid expansion through the private option, tort reform, and education reform. Republican Senator Jake Files of Fort Smith also says private option will be huge and probably the latter part of the session. He also says prisons will be a hot topic, what to do with all the inmates or to build a new $231 million prison. Coming up on the news at 6, we'll show you one of the bills that will likely cause quite the talk. Yuna Lee, 4029 News.